Shalom. All praises to the Most High. Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. Revelation 13, 16. And he calls us all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Strong G, 5480, Haragma, Haragma. A stamp, an imprinted mark, of the mark stamped on the forehead or the right hand as the badge of the followers of the Antichrist. The mark branded upon horses, thing carved, sculpture, graven work of idolatrous images. Thing carved, sculpture, graven work, which imply that you are making an incision into something to break the surface or to penetrate the surface, or the flesh in that case, such as a needle to implement a microchip, whether it be a RFID, BCI, any form of technology, to buy or to sell. A point where if we have a chip in our brain, and, and you out there have a chip in your brain, we can communicate. We can communicate without talking. We can communicate when you're halfway around the world. And we can exchange knowledge. So, if you look at a world where we have these chips that are connected to the internet, all of a sudden, every piece of information on the internet becomes accessible to our minds. Now, when we look back at today and we have to go to Baidu or Google and type it in, that will seem so primitive. Nobody will do that. You will just think, what knowledge do I need? And it will appear there for you to use. But it gets even weirder. Yes, it does. And don't think that that brain-to-brain -brain communication only stops there. They can use that same technology to place it in your head, to make transactions for you to buy and sell halfway around the world, and all kind of things. <clears throat> Revelations 20 and 4. And I saw thrones, and they sat upon them, and judgment was given unto them. And I saw the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Yahawashai. And for the word of the Most High, Yahweh, and which had not worshipped the beast, neither his image, neither had received his mark upon their foreheads or in their hands, and they lived and reigned with the Hamashiach, Yahawashai, a thousand years. Don't take that mark. Don't take that mark. With that being said, Shalom.